वेलकम टू सेशन इन दिस सेशन वी डिस्कस दी फॉलोइंग क्वेश्चन दैट सेज पी क्यू आर एस इज अ क्वाड्री लैक्ट्रल इन विच क्यू आर इज इक्वल टू आर एस ओ एम इज दी राइट बाय सेक्टर ऑफ पी क्यू एंड ओ एन इज दी राइट बाय सेक्टर ऑफ पी एस प्रूव दैट ओ आर बाय सेक्स एंगल क्यू आर एस बिफोर यू वी वॉन्ट टू दी सोल्यूशन लेट्स डिस्कस दी लोकल फोन टू बी यूज इन द सोल्यूशन अकॉर्डिंग टू दिस वी हैव The locus of a point equidistant from two fixed points is the right bisector. of the straight line joining the fixed points this is the key idea that we use in this question let's now move on to the solution we are given this quadrilateral pqrs in which qr is equal to rs and oi is the right bisector of pq and oi is the right bisector of ps so we have a quadrilateral pqrs the side qr is equal to the side rs of the quadrilateral then on is the right bisector of ps and on is the right bisector of pq and we are supposed to prove that this or bisects angle qrs for this first of all we join op oq and os now as we have om is the right bisector of ps this means that o lies on the right bisector of ps from the key idea we have that the locus of a point equidistant from two fixed points is the right bisector of the straight line joining the fixed point this means that every point lying on the right bisector of the straight line joining the two points is equidistant from the two points therefore as we see that o lies on the right bar sector of ps so this o would be equidistant from the points p and s that is op is equal to os let this be result 1 now let's we have om is the right bisector 
of PQ. This means that O lies on the right bisector of PQ and so this O would be equidistant from the points P and Q. That is OP would be equal to OQ. Let this be result 2. Now from the results 1 and 2 we have that OS would be equal to OQ. That is this OS is equal to OQ. Let this be result 3. Next we consider the triangles ROS and ROQ. In these two triangles RO is equal to RO that is the common side to both the triangles. Then QR is equal to RS as it is given to us. And next is OS is equal to OQ from the result 3. That is this result. And so therefore we say that the triangle ROS is congruent to the triangle ROQ by SSS congruency criteria. Now as these two triangles are congruent, therefore we have that angle ORS is equal to the angle ORQ by CPCT that is as they are the corresponding parts of the congruent triangle so they are equal. And this means that OR bisects angle QRS since these two angles are equal. And this is what we were supposed to prove. So, hence proved. This completes the session. Hope you have understood the solution of this question.